My name is Elena Radaelli and I teach ICT at a middle school back in Milan, Italy, called Collegio San Carlo. I heard about the European Schoolnet Academy back in 2014 when it actually was born thanks uh, to one of the newsletters that uh, the Ministry of Education here in Italy sends to teachers. And I actually discovered the unique uh, opportunity to take part uh, to amazing pedagogical courses uh, on the most uh, recent educational approaches and uh, technologies. I think that everything that I have learned through these courses has led me to uh, a more interactive approach uh, in terms of really just like playing the role of the mentor more than the traditional teacher. And not only because, I mean, you use digital tools in which students are always, you know, very much involved, but because, for example, if I can quote one of the courses that I recently took up and related to open schooling, that provided me with a new perspective in terms of asking uh, external experts, such as, you know, museums experts, uh, community experts, uh, to interact uh, within uh, the uh, learning, uh, you know, process of our students. So having outdoor experiences, but not just like outdoor and that's it, but saying, hey, I will get some experience at outside and I will bring it back to school and I will therefore enrich and be a good learner, a good inquirer and a good problem solver. So I think that this is given thanks to the fact that Courses are so well structured, they really provide you hands on tools and at the same time the possibility to share them and see if they work or don't work or how they work uh, together with an incredible network of teachers. All these courses are so valuable, uh, both on a professional and uh, a personal level, because they really give the opportunity to teachers to handle several issues in terms of uh, um, teaching and uh, pedagogy. And uh, first of all, to give a 360 degree approach to your day by day teaching, uh, but actually using uh, innovative uh, um, tools, uh, innovative digital tools. And I think that's both professionally and both personally, it is amazing the fact that you can get in touch with so many teachers all around Europe and you can really create a network that goes beyond the course and that even is um, an opportunity to just face up uh, your strong or weak points in your teaching, but it's just like in a very, very, very enriching way. As for example, through the peer-to-peer -peer evaluation, which I think that it's uh, one of the hardest points at the very end of a course when you have to prepare a paper, or when you have to do research or prepare a project. Um, but then you have the opportunity really to get in touch with people that do your the same job you do, but in another country with another perspective and have had different experiences and therefore can uh, give you the chance to see your teaching in another way. So it's really tough to say that it's just professional or just personal. It's really 50 -50. I can't wait actually to attend other courses. Right now I'm finishing up with a great, great enthusiasm uh, games at school. And I can't wait actually to uh, hear and see other teachers that are as passionate as I am. And if I had the chance, just I would tell you, just like take part, attend them, attend them as much as you can because that's not the future, that's actually the present.